Hey guys, I'm just here with uh, my old man. I'm not an old. I'm not old, David. I'm, You're 48, feel, 40, do, 48. No, 68. 60, oh, 86, yeah, 66, 68. Uh, Magic here, just been to see him. Uh, my mom's over there, for those of you that are thinking, she'd say hello, mom. Hello, mom. There you go. She's uh, she's out of hospital. I know a lot of you have been asking, um, and she's on the oxygen. So if there's a noise in the background, that's the oxygen. Uh, Magic's going to be, uh, I know a lot of you want to, want to talk uh, and hear what he's got to say regarding uh, the situation with Wolves. We thought we'd have a quick chat with Magic, uh, get his take on everything, Dad. How are you feeling about the fact that um, Lopetegui is gone? Yeah. And um, obviously the new manager, Gary O'Neill, coming in, the exports. First of all, what what's your take on the Lopetegui thing? I don't think he wanted to stay here from the beginning, so... I know he got me out of the rink in trouble, but I think you know, got me out of all the players Come did. Talk up a bit, Dad. Well, the players did, don't they, David? But I mean, I don't think he wanted to stay here at the beginning because he, unless he, I, I don't understand it anyway, because you know, six months back he said he was got, he threatened to leave, and now he's proved he's there, he's got. So. Yeah, I mean, obviously, there's a lot of, he went out, obviously, rogue behind the thing yeah. but there's a lot of people that did interviews behind the club's back but there's a lot of people that's obviously from the statements that he was promised certain things that weren't forthcoming oh, obviously right. they've not spent a lot of money in this window they did spend a lot of money in january oh, okay. um but how damaging do you think it is that it's like five oh, days before the start of the season all yeah, this has that, happened that was bad david yeah that was bad wasn't it? I just wanted to leave, day and that's it. I don't think he wanted to buy that player, and he couldn't have that player. So he says, OK, I'm off. That was it. He was straight from the beginning, I don't think. I don't think. I thought he was a good manager, but it's behind the scenes, what's going on with the money. And the, uh, I, don't, I don't know what to make out of it. But he's he, gone now, and let's hope this fellow who comes in could do something. To, uh, I ain't sure about him, but let's see what happens. Yeah, well, Gary O'Neill's coming, as you say. Um, and Magic will be on the uh, the Man United preview, so you'll be uh, back with uh, your songs for everyone, Dad. Uh, Gary O'Neill's coming. Um, was the Bournemouth manager, took over interim, was made permanent, um, took over when they were 16th. Yeah, um, uh, they did drop into the uh, the bottom three, but he got them out. They finished 15th, two places behind Wolves. Yeah. Uh, a British manager, he's well, 40. That's, that's, that's nice. He's, he's, uh... Um, obviously, his first day at Wolves today. We're waiting on uh, more. Obviously, there'll be an interview from Wolves. He's got his first press conference tomorrow. He? Oh, anyway. um, he's got to get to know the players for three or four days after pre-season under a completely different manager, a completely different set of coaches. Yeah. He's come in. He's having to put coaching staff in. Yeah. It's not just the manager that's gone from Wolves. It's the entire coaching staff as well. Five days before the start oh, of the well, season, he's, the coaching stuff, he's putting together a, a various coaches. He's already brought a, a two or three in from oh, his contacts. Oh, um, I think he's been around quite a bit, hasn't he? Well, in, he's been, well, he's been around in terms of coaching and stuff like that. He, he's been an assistant. He stepped up. He's quite in terms of like managerial positions. He's quite inexperienced. Because, I mean, he's on Bournemouth which was a Premier League job. He kept him up. He's now the manager of Wolves. You know, it's not really a sexy appointment. Um, he's not got that much experience. It is um, a little bit of a concern. Is it a gamble? But they've they've had to get someone in quick. Yeah. They've given him a three-year yeah, contract. Yeah, a crowd of beyond to them, wouldn't they? Oh, I mean, so from your point of view, um, are you excited? Are you worried? I'm worried. You're worried? Yeah. Tell everyone what you're worried about. Well, he, he got to prove himself. I hope he does prove himself a good bit, manager. Dad. But, uh... Dad, can you talk up a little bit? <laughs> Thanks. <laughs> I feel a little bit off. Uh, well, he's yeah, I mean, got to prove himself. Well, let's see what he let's, let's, let's hope he does. So I am very struck, but I mean, that's his age. But he, 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 uh, you know, he's got to prove himself. I, I hope he proves himself to me. But at the moment, I am very struck. You're not very struck. But sometimes yeah, you come in with low expectations. He's expect a good English bloke. He's a bloody British. 
and he's probably got a bit of more bottle in him and get them. I mean, they played well the other day. You said they played, they played really well. 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 So if they keep playing like that, they should be okay. Let's hope they can beat Man United. And do you think they can? Well, we'll have to wait for Magic's preview yeah, of course on, on the preview for uh, for your score prediction. Yeah, yeah. At the end of the day, Dad, there's been a lot of uncertainty around the club. Yeah. We've still got... Over the years, David, how many money do we've had? Well... We had got rid of the last one before. They wouldn't give him any money. And Dono, that was his name, Duno. Not Dono. <laughs> Dono. I don't know who Dono is. Duno. I mean, Duno. We like he, Duno. He, he, he wanted some money, they. And they wouldn't back him, would they? Do Same you... as the last man you just wouldn't go. That's what a um, paper talk and everybody else talk. They wouldn't back him. So I what mean, do you think of the this chairman? Fellow, this, well, I don't the know. chairman Jeff Shee, who's uh, yeah. do you think he's a lot to blame for some of what's been going on? Well, that's the back stuff, eh? You know, he doesn't want to go on behind the back. The foes out. What was the name? Was, uh, what, Futsal. Was, that's uh, the football thing. Foes. Yeah, they were going to. Sp- we were going to be top of the league the way they was talking. But it's... I don't know. I don't, You're don't, frustrated, don't, aren't you? I am frustrated. And I, that's, I thought this man who just left, I thought he was a genuine sort of a fella. Mm. But he wore no intentions of staying. He wanted his own way. And all that sort of thing. But the wolves are bigger than that. So they, Well, the one thing that you've always bought... I can't understand why the, this money business, I can't understand it. Well, the one thing you've always brought me up on, Dad, is trying to be open and yeah, fair and listening and get it. balanced views. You've always what you you like genuine people, yeah, that's um, and that's what you thought Lopetegui was. But you're saying he was a bit disingenuous because of the way he's acted. Yeah, well, yeah he wanted his own way, Dad. He wanted his top dog, and you know, he, he, I, don't, I don't know. Oh, I, I, I thought he was going to be a good manager, but I was all very keen on his way he acted and all that sort of thing. So. Did Where's you, he gone anyway? He ain't gone anywhere. He's gone home to Spain with a nice big paycheck in the back with, us, right, with a few yeah, million pounds probably, in his back probably pocket. Got, probably got a, a manager job waiting over there more than likely. Well, well. He, he'll, he'll get another job because he's he's been successful and he, he you know he kept us up and we're thankful for that, aren't we? For keeping players us up. kept him up, don't they? The players, yeah. Players did he? He's talking. Talk. The players kept me up. But he was the man. Nevis and all them blinking, all gone. Collins, blinking, Marina, what are they called? They all left, are they? He got, they got rid of him. Whether it was the back staff child got, got to get rid of him or it was his idea, you don't know, do you? Well, Dad, we'll soon find out. But oh. what's your message? Um, say Gary O'Neill was watching this, the new Wolves manager. Good luck to him. Come on, what are you going to say? Gary O'Neill's watching this. Oh, hello, Gary. Hello, Gary. <laughs> hello, Gary. Gary O'Neill's watching this. He's just come in our club. You've obviously supported the club pretty much all your life I since have, you yeah. moved my up. Da- and, my dad used to take me. And like you take me, and I now take yeah, you, yeah, do, and bring yeah, you back. Yeah. If Gary O'Neill, Wolves' new head coach, is watching this, what would you like to say to him? What did we want? Good luck to him. Good luck. Let's get... <laughs> You've got to keep winning matches, you've got to score goals and all that sort of thing. You know, we'll see what he does. I hope he's I hope he proves himself. I oh, yeah, very struck at the moment, but you know, we've got to see what he can do. But I think he, he I don't think he'll be okay, but you never know. I hope he proves me wrong, but I hope he's I hope he's a top freaking manager and show it all of them. All and what if you're talking to Gary O'Neill, what little tip would you give him as a fan to say to him about the Wolves fans and stuff, what tip would you say that the fans expect more than anything else? Well, the, the, the Wolves fans expect Wolves to play football and a bit of bottle in them, like, you know, that's, oh, I can't think Play of with passion. Play with passion. Play for the badge. Uh, play for the play, play for the Wolves, play, play for Wolverhampton. And that's what you're going to do. I mean, I remember the old days, but I mean, there's different days today. It's all, it's all money, 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 money. And if they're making no money for seven minutes, I can't understand why they keep selling players. Well, it's well somebody do. comes in from Gilman, nobody's going to sell him. The best player on the blinking ground. Gilman, Kilman. Kilman, yeah. I mean, you remember, you remember Bennett? <laughs> we do remember Bennett, Dad. <laughs> he was my favourite and Gilman was my favourite. Well, you like Bonanza, don't you? I like Bonanza. He might be back in now. Well, uh, well, Not for tag, he's gone. He might, you never know, he might... Might be back in favour again. What's that? With his face, they fit, did it? And that's what it is. All the, 
Yeah, I don't know what comes. Ashley Johnson says that you should be O'Neill's assistant. Oh, good. Oh, yeah, I don't know. What I, who, who, put your hand up if you think magic. We should start a campaign for magic to be a uh, yeah part of the yeah uh, part of the backroom staff. I reckon yeah, there'll be a few down you, for that. You should be, Dad. You can get in the in the changing you room and talk, do a bit of a boom box with you them, Dad. Talk better than me, I used to be Dad, you, you've been in the changing rooms of Bilston, most oh, debated, well, or Bilston well, Town. The way they played, oh, yeah, going to go down that way. <laughs> anyway, Dad, so basically, I, I think it's fair thing. If you've got a message to the Wolves fans now um, yeah, about... Back him, back him. Back him. And they will do. And they will do. They'll they'll do that, but that, if you don't get it right... The clothes will be onto the wolf management. Absolutely. They will be. If they, they, we'll think the players there are good enough because they played well the other day when you told me. But I'll think they'll. All the, I'll tell you when the, you open you, what you told me is you told me that they played brilliant. And if they play like you told me, they should be okay. Absolutely. And basically, you're right what you're saying. We are, you're worried. I'm I not going to be. I'm, not, I have, I'm a bit concerned, but I am. Woody, Woody, I'm concerned how he can prove himself. Yeah, well, I, well I, I'm obviously worried, and I'm not normally not. I've like been quite confident, especially after the weekend. But we have got a good squad. That's the right. new manager's here now. Yeah. He's now in place. It, it, and you're absolutely it, right. Yeah. Every single Wolves uh, fan, whether they've got worries, concerns, doubts or whatever, they need to get behind the manager and the boys yeah. and support him and hope that you know, it might be able to bring it. You know, we've player. got low expectations, but maybe he'll exceed expectations, that's and it. and he'll that's be, that's he'll it. be, uh, he'll be the next brilliant yeah. young man, British yeah, manager. Yeah, be, yeah, it could be. Yeah. <laughs> uh, one thing said, said here, I've got to, you've got to do this for this lad. Uh, this chap here says, my younger brother Ben loves magic. Can you give him a shout out? So can you say hello to Ben? Hello, Ben. Look after yourself, Ben. It's a hard life out there if you don't weaken. That's what Dad used to say. It's a hard life out there if you don't weaken. Absolutely. <laughs> all the best, Ben. All the best to you, mate. Look after yourself. Absolutely. Absolutely, mate. Um, I'm just trying to have a look if there's uh, anything else here that I'm going to need. <laughs> I beg your, I beg your pardon. Uh, Dad, looking to, uh, to, to head uh, to the future for now, obviously with the squad that we've got and everything, do you think at this point in time, now the uncertainty, someone said, oh, there it is, Ashley Johnson makes a good price. I'm happy that the uncertainty is over. I think Ashley makes a really good point because there's been a lot of uncertainty over the club with what's happening with yeah, the managerial yeah. system and behind the scenes because will he stay, will he go, all the, the behind the closed doors stuff that we don't know is going out, go in doing all these separate interviews. We've got a manager that wants to be here. That's right, that's it. Um, He's a young manager and he wants to prove himself. So hopefully he can do, because the crowd will get behind him if he gets them. If he gets them going, they, yeah. they definitely will. But, but like, he's actually it's right, the, the uncertainty's ended. It's not ideal just before the start of the season, but no. we know who's going to be in charge now. Yeah, yeah. So that's a really, really good... He, he'd been threatening to go in the last pre six months as well, as I can remember. Absolutely. Andy Clement says that you're a legend, Dad. <laughs> I've, uh, I've been around a bit. Uh, Play with no fear. Uh, Daniel right, says, uh, Dad. Yeah, I'll put it right in Google. Um, oh, yeah. Um, this chap wants to know if you've got a message to Lopetegui. Bye-bye. Bye-bye. <laughs> <laughs> I love it, Dad. I love it. So... Looking ahead, because we've got the last couple of minutes of this little uh, chat with you. Yeah. Looking ahead to the season, should Wolves fans be uh, really worried about relegation or do you think we'll be OK? Right this second, where do you think we'll finish out of 20 next year? Well, I'm only going what you told me, David. You said they played well the other day, so I'm a little bit concerned, David, but I think they'll be OK. That's a lot okay. Stuff. I'm going on what you told me you said they played well. And we showed you the highlights and, and everything. Yeah, and hopefully yeah. you'll be there for the Brighton game. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And you'll be watching the Man United game. Oh, definitely. That will be well. And yeah. you'll be subscribed to because you subscribed to you watch all the um all the videos and the reactions yeah, yeah, back. Yeah, yeah. What position right this second out of twenty are Wolves gonna finish next year? Right this second, what's your gut tell you? Well, I hope I stop in this top half, I saw So what's your position? Out of 20? Uh, I'll say 10, go on. 
tenth. Well, I hope again. I used to say they're going to win the league. I'm dad, but at the moment, I think get, if they get can stop in that league and, and this chap Gary out there, he might bring a couple. Be able to bring a couple of players in. I don't know. But I mean, Bournemouth. He do well at Bournemouth, so why can't he do well at Brinkley Wall? Well, yeah, well, yeah, well, and hopefully we've got a higher quality of squad as well. Yeah. So you're going tenth. Yeah. I'll take that right now, Dad. I, yeah. If I could put a guarantee on tenth right now, I, yeah. that would be an improvement. It would be. Uh, how about a, uh, an, an FA Cup final? Oh, definitely. Do you fancy a bit of abide with me? Yeah. Abide with me. Yeah, 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 yeah. Uh, we want to sing that at Wembley, yeah, don't we? Certainly do. Certainly do, Dad. Let's do. hope we have a good cup run as well, guys. Um, any final questions for Magic before we before he uh, he goes? If you've got any quick questions, ask him now, and he will be on the match preview for uh, for Manchester United. Who will? <laughs> you will. You've got your because you've got your cuddly toy and you've got your song, ain't you? And your prediction. When? It, after this, we're recording it ready. Oh, 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 he knows this. He's playing up. Oh no, I'll forget nowadays. What? Um, what's your favourite Wolves jersey of all time, Dad, or shirt? Good year. The good year one. You like that one, dear? <laughs> yeah. Yeah, that's a good fame as well. All the, all the fame. Let's, and, uh, Dad, I'll tell you what. Let's hope it's a good year. Well, that's, that's Let's hope it is yeah, a good year. He definitely year. will be, David. He definitely will be. I think this fellow, fellow who's just come in, I think he'll prove we... All wrong. Uh, all wrong. Or all right. Oh, hey, wrong. Or, I'm just a bit concerned. He'll, pro he'll, he'll prove to be good. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I'm out. Uh, 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 Leighton Harris. Oh, best away, Dad. Well, you don't go to many, but you went to Tottenham last year, didn't you? Yeah, yeah. He enjoyed that. Has he gone or what? Uh, well, no, Pod Pedantra's training yet. How many goals will will Bonanza get next season <laughs> if he doesn't go? <laughs> I like that. I like that question. I like that. How many goals? Oh, God. How many? Oh, so he, he had get... six last year. Oh, he'll, he'll, he'll score 10 this year. He will finish 10th and he'll score 10. You like the number 10, yeah, don't you? Um, Magic, how many signings are we going to get this summer? Are we going to bring anyone else in? I hope so, David. That's why he left there. He could, he could get signed with anybody. But... Carl, what's, I don't know, I don't know. what's the best home game you've ever seen? I The best oh, home well, game? Oh, well, Leeds. We used to play Leeds and Liverpool and all them. We used to be a top team one time when we played Liverpool. We We're not a top team now. We always be, we are still a top team, but we always be Wolves and Liverpool at one stage. Now it's Man United, man. It's all money, 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 money. And what a player. I mean, it's like Man City. We did Man United. Man City, the board uh, player, Jock, or what? That was Liverpool. Yeah, he, he went to Liverpool, and they, they buy all our best players, and they've all gone, and they've all done well, and so on. But, I mean, they can't keep getting rid of your best players. You've got to keep them, or you're going to get in the top four. Or, That's the message you know, to the team, don't yeah. sell any more of our players. You no, know, I, I was worried when they were going to sell... Was it Gilman, eh? Was it... Uh, Gilbert, <laughs> but you can call him Gilbert because you can call him anything that you like. That's... I mean, he'd have gone, and what, what would have happened then? It was money, 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 money. That's all to think about. You, if you want to stop in that league, you've got to get some players in. I mean, West Ham, what they freaking money they where did why can't we spend money to keep money, money about? We can't spend no money. Another question What's the best player you've ever seen oh. other than Bennett? <laughs> we have a lot of people remember Dugan and all them so and Johnny Hancock and Billy Wright and so which one Johnny Hancock uh, Billy Wright yeah yeah Billy Wright I'll go for Billy Wright because he he kept the team but there's a lot of good players Bailey and was all good players I mean Kenny Ibbett he's really played out and so on he was a good fellow he was there's a good lot of players and the goalkeepers and all sorts you know but that's life eh? that's the way it goes, it goes on but I mean the different football today it is you know I think, and I agree. What the, I agree. One thing I agree is not wasting time. And I agree with the FA, whatever they call us out. They're going to stop that because that's what they do. They play for time. Ashley says yeah. he's jealous that your father has seen these brilliant players. The other thing is, don't forget that with wasting time, they're that they, they, they they've got longer injury time now, added time because every time they waste time, they're adding it on. That's now. right, that's right. You like that, don't uh, you? Yeah, yeah. Because what they do. A tumble down, somebody knocking. And have them. you been what, enjoying watching the girls, the England girls play? Well, certainly, yeah. I'm there on me. I was just, I, I was very pleased with what that girl did the other day. Did she, she has apologised. Yeah, she did. She's only young and she'll yeah, learn. She, she did, she did, she did, she did. She's had a two-match ban. 
she, so okay. that means she will if we get to the final they'll be they should be available oh well, that'd be brilliant david i don't know that i don't know that oh very good absolutely very good so yeah guys keep the faith hope you've enjoyed this little chat with magic uh thanks for sending the love to my mom uh we you know we're doing the best she's keeping positive uh, as, a, as a fighter she is just uh, like me as a fighter like me hey you mom say to all to everyone mom there you go what she said she's 84 she's been through a lot and um she's got um a lot of things at the moment but we love it a bit and your support helps dad and us so thank you so much for that yeah, yeah. um keep the faith, keep the faith. get behind the manager get behind, get behind the team yeah, get behind. keep your fingers crossed yes, David. let's hope he's right when we get 10th place and an fa cup final because if we have you will be like mystic mod oh, not right. magic mods right. because you will literally have been predicting the future is that right no. Um, and I'll be staying in the league as well. <laughs> uh, Adam says, "Love you, love you, magic." That's lovely, eh? It? Guys, thank you very much. If you want to hear Dad um, and his prediction for Man United, make sure you subscribe, hit the channel, hit the the like button, and don't forget all these. If we do a live, you can always join in the chat if you subscribe. So, Dad, we're going to finish this off now, and. Um, we're going to go and record the uh, the Man United stuff ready to come out over the uh, the next couple of days with his prediction. Oh, is that right? Yeah. Okay. And from me and Magic, yeah. always Wolves. Look after yourselves. And... Always Wolves. Always. <laughs> always. <laughs> always. I always have been. And I was born in Kent. And he always will be. And I always will be. Love you all. Love you all. Look after yourselves. It's a bit hard out there, but we'll get to it. Oh, no, it's fun. Thanks, Dad. Yeah.